What's up, brother? How you doing, man? Congratulations being on this big stage, brother. Good to see you. Uh, yeah, the fight, uh, I saw you running on the trails. The fight almost didn't happen. I saw you almost stepped on a rattlesnake. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, as many people that know me know that I love nature. I love I love animals. And and the, where I run right over there in San Diego, there's a nice trail, beautiful trail, where I get to see coyotes. I get to see rabbits. I get to see snakes. I get to see deer. So it's always a good run over there. But one of my encounters was a rattlesnake, so it got a little dangerous after a while. <laughs> right, for sure. Uh, man, it got pretty heated up there with the face-off. Uh, I just started laughing. What, what words was he telling you, man? What was he telling you? Well, I started laughing because right now I'm very focused on the main object. You know, I'm not here to to talk smack, to, to push him, to you know, to sell this this fight that you know it doesn't need to be sold because you know it's, the fight sells itself. Um, I'm not here for that. I'm here to win. I'm here to win it uh, this Saturday night. I'm here to give him my best and do whatever it takes to bring my belts back home with me. And you know, obviously Shakur's style is more is more like to get into the boxer's head. And the reason why I laugh because there's nothing he can say right now that can make me lose focus. You know, right now, like I said, I'm not here to talk back to him. Or I'm here to win the fight. And that's the most important thing for me. I see Manny Robles uh, told me, you know, never count Oscar Valdez out. He he always finds a way to win. Man, what what does that mean? You coming from your, your former guy? It means a lot because uh, obviously I got a lot of love and respect. And, and uh, Manny Robles and Edgar Caso are two great trainers who I admire and I appreciate them and I love them like my family. And I will always know, I will always thank them for because they the, the ones who made me a world champion at 126 and they made me become the fighter that I am. I still got uh, their tips, their, their work ethic, I still have it to this day. And that's something that I will always uh, be appreciate. I will appreciate from them. I will, I will be thankful for them. So um, I, um, it means a lot. It means a lot to hear from uh, those words from Manny because obviously they, we know how we work. They know how we work. And, and at the same time, us winning is a little bit of a victory as well because they helped me become the fighter that I am right now. Definitely, man. Appreciate your time, man. Thank you so much. All of you.